Welcome to another tag video. This tag video is called If I Were a Tag, created by Bits and Bags, but I have been tagged by my two kind and gorgeous friends here on YouTube, Flo in the City and Lux Granny Grace, but now her channel's name is called Bold and Gracious. So thank you ladies for tagging me and guys what are you waiting for go check their channels I'm going to put their links in the, in the description box below Without further ado, let's just go ahead and start with this tag video This tag video is quite fun and easy for me to do because all I did was to look in my collection the things I love, I love wearing, I love to use, and I have been uh, gravitating towards uh, for the past few months, although everybody knows that we don't go out uh, regularly because of the pandemic. However, since it's a tag video, well, I don't have any choice but to look carefully on what specific items I would choose for this tag so uh, before I start guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel please consider subscribing don't forget to turn that notification bell on so you don't miss out all the videos I upload by the way I'm MC and I'm into luxury fashion lifestyle and beauty so in this tag video there are six categories uh, number one is if I were a bag Number two, if I were an SLG, if I were a shoe, if I were a perfume, if I were a makeup, and number six is a wild card, which I would like you to guess. So before I forget, by the way, I would like to tag some of my friends here on YouTube, and I'm going to put their names in the description box below. I hope you ladies do the tag as well. So for the first category, if I were a bag tag, this is my pick, which is the Chanel uh, Jumbo or large in the caviar leather. I love this so much. You're probably tired seeing me uh, with this bag, but I, what, I, what else can I do? It's Chanel. It's such an expensive bag with all the price increases over the uh, years, you know. And I think this is a well, worth investment. It's classic, classy. Um, we've said so many things about this, good things about this bag, uh, but others say that it's, you know, heavy. Uh, for me, I don't feel it's heavy. It's that heavy. It's very, very elegant, but you can dress this up or down. So I chose this. Um, if you remember my video, um, it's also a tag video. It's the bag that best represents me. I chose the Lady Dior. However, that bag cannot be worn every day, unlike this one. You can wear this every day if you want to. And it's easily, you know, it can easily be dressed down. So... You can see that mine is in gold hardware and I also uh, bought this organizer so to maintain its size and shape especially when stored so I love this um, the sad thing about Chanel is they don't have a boutique or outlet or boutique here in the Philippines not even a not a single one that's why i don't know when can i expand or add more uh, chanel bags to my collection now for srg it's going to be my louis vuitton uh, mini pochette in the damier event so it's very cute very functional versatile uh, purse because you know it's a small but surprisingly roomy you can put all your basic uh, tiny essentials in this purse like this one i still have my hermes lipstick inside and a mac 
makeup setting spray so i can also put all my cards in here debit cards credit cards uh cash coins uh what else makeup you know small perfumes cologne so on and so forth so like i said it's very very functional and you can also make use of this as a an organizer bag organizer now if i go out for an errand and i don't need a handbag a handbag with me i just grab this and go this is my favorite slg from louis vuitton for shoe it would be my louis vuitton slingback pumps how gorgeous this pair is you can see the lv logo here it's in yellow uh, gold hardware and this one is silver so 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 pretty and these shoes are very comfortable to wear i remember the first time i wore this it was my daughter's graduation and the parking lot was so far from the venue but with this one i didn't feel uh uncomfortable it's very uh, you know you can wear this long distance walk with it uh, long distance that's why i love it and the white you know i love white it's very easy to pair with um you can wear this with anything and everything especially here that it's very hot it's summer and white is perfect uh, to wear because it's neutral So this is also is in the kitten heels and yeah it's a low heel uh, pumps that's why it's very very comfortable i love it and so if i were a perfume tag i would be this jo malone cologne i love this this is in the travel size and i am planning to buy a bigger size so i can enjoy it much I love the scent of this it's called mimosa and cardamom love 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 this it stays uh, longer than other you know i don't know but i like it it's sweet there's a floral and powdery scent to it hmm it's actually one of my favorite perfumes or colognes moving on if i were a makeup tag it would be supposed to be <laughs> this lipstick from chanel it's one of my favorite lipsticks it's the velvet allure i love the shade the color you know um before the pandemic i used to uh, wear lipstick even without makeup just lipstick would do me good however since the pandemic uh, wearing a lipstick is useless because you know i always have to wear um uh, masks all the time that is why i changed my mind and i have to pick this one um it's the uh, studio mac fix this one if i wear this oops this is what it looks like it's the cushion foundation and i love it it's a little bit dark and i plan to buy a lighter shade which will be in the shade nc this one is nc30 so i'm planning to buy nc25 now this one even if you wear a mask it doesn't smear you know it's it stays in place it's very good very light and long wearing so this will be my pick for the makeup category let's now go to the last category which is a wild card and i'm not sure if you're able to guess it but this is it this is my cartier justin clue bracelet i picked this because it's beautiful it's unique it's elegant and I've worn this so many times already since I bought it. It was a gift for my birthday this year, January. So I chose this over the bracelet, over the love bracelet because, you know, 
I didn't have the size at the time but I don't have any regret or I didn't regret buying this because I can buy the love bracelet later on <laughs> I wish and I hope my size is going to be available very soon so this is it love 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 this I've worn it so many times already and I think jewelry is the only item luxury item that you can wear every day uh, despite the pandemic you can wear it at home it doesn't matter you know when you go out or what very very beautiful I love it so that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching I hope you've enjoyed if you have any question or suggestion feel free to leave them in the comment section down below I'll get back to you as soon as I can I'll see you on my next one bye